Welcome to Inference Strategy Lesson Part 2. In this lesson, I will think aloud as I apply the inference making strategy that you learned about in Part 1 in order to make inferences based on words from Mother to Son by Langston Hughes. Please read the poem before watching the flipped mini lesson. The formula for making inferences is this, what the author has told me plus what I know from my experiences equals an educated guess. In the poem, the mother, the speaker of the poem, describes her life for her son by comparing it to stairs. Hers is not a stair made of crystal. Right after reading this part of the poem, the image of a crystal chandelier pops into my head. I have been in the homes of people experiencing poverty, and I have never seen crystal chandeliers hanging in these homes. However, I have looked at pictures of homes of wealthy people, and I have seen crystal chandeliers in these pictures. Crystals must be expensive. I can add my experiences to the text, and I'm ready to make an inference. I infer that the mother has not experienced wealth. The mother goes on to describe her life as a stair with tacks and torn up boards on it. I've stepped on a tack. It hurt. I can imagine that stepping on a torn up board would be dangerous. It could cause someone to sprain an ankle. I can add my experiences to the text and I am ready to make an inference. I infer that the mother's life has been painful and dangerous. Now it's your turn to make an inference. Please read the sixth line of the poem, Mother to Son by Langston Hughes. Consider what the poet has told you. Add to that what you know from your personal experiences. Then you can make an educated guess, an inference. Please post your inference in the online classroom. I look forward to practicing inference making with you in class.